Good morning, everyone. Um, I thought that today, I'm not on my morning walk. Today is Saturday, and this is my home. And we're looking at a new play right now. So I thought I'd take this opportunity to read some quotes in Miracle. Lesson 14. So, key lesson 14. God did not create the new world. The idea for today is, of course, the reason why a new world is impossible. What God did not create does not exist. And everything that does exist exists as He created it. The world you see has nothing to do with reality. It is of your own making. And it does not exist. The exercise for today are to practice with eyes closed throughout. The mind searching period should be short, a minute at most. Do not have more than three practice periods for today's idea unless you find them comfortable. If you do, it will be because you really understand what they are. The idea for today is another step in learning to let go the thoughts that you have written on the world and see the world and see the words of God in their place. The only the early steps in this exchange, which can truly be called salvation, can be quite difficult and even quite painful. Some of them will lead you directly into fear. You will not be left there. You will go far beyond it. Our direction is toward perfect safety and perfect peace. With eyes closed, think of all the horrors in the world that cross your mind. Name each one as it occurs to you, and then, deny, and, the, and then deny its reality. God did not create it, and so it is not real. Say, for example, God did not create that war, and so it is not real. God did not create that airplane crash, and so it is not real. God did not create that disaster and specify the disaster, and so it is not real. Suitable subjects for the application of today's idea also include anything you are afraid might happen to you, or to anyone about whom you are concerned. In each case, name the disaster quite specifically. Do not use general terms. For example, do not say, God did not create illness. But, God did not create cancer, or a heart attack, or whatever may arouse fear in you. This is your personal repertory of horrors. At which you are looking. These things are part of the world you see. Some of them are shared illusions and others are part of your personal hell. It does not matter. What God did not create can only be in your own mind apart from his. Therefore, it has no meaning. In recognition of this fact, Conclude the practice period by repeating today's idea. God did not create a meaningless world. Mom. Hi, Queen. Mom. Yeah, yeah. We're reading. The idea for today can, of course, be applied to anything that disturbs you during the day. Aside from the practice period, be very specific in, a, in applying it. Say, God did not create a meaningless world. He did not create, specify the situation which is disturbing you. And so, it is not real. Okay. So I can sleep on today. Okay. I'll get to 